Carla. And I'm Paula. And we're taking stock of this week's stock journal. So first up on the front page this week, Paula, there's a few grain growers that are pretty upset I hear. Yeah, it's an issue that's been going on for a while. It's a bit of a tussle between the joint representative organisations as Grain Producers Australia and Grain Growers Limited. Um, basically, there's a bit of upset because Grain Growers Limited actually get their membership. You actually have to opt out if you don't want to be a member. So a lot of people are saying that's unfair and basically means they have a lot bigger numbers than they actually would if people actually chose to go with them. So yeah, Colin Bettles has written a great yarn about that for our front page this week. Yep. And markets are continuing to crack along pretty well. Absolutely. It's a fantastic time to be in the cattle game at the moment. Uh, we had the Alice Spring sale on Thursday last week and they had two new records. Uh, they had $3.10 a kilo for heifers and $3 a kilo for steers. So that's sensational. And they both uh, went to SA Bio out of Princess Royal, our Borough way. And then Mount Gambier, three dollars seventy a kilo yeah. Friday last week, which is just <laughs> incredible. Not bad. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And I understand dairy guys have got some good news as well. Yeah, a few people out there like their cheese uh, by the sounds of things. So uh, there's been quite a bit of interest in southeast dairy properties recently, uh, including from the Beston Group. So in investors looking to go and um, secure a few properties down there and I guess get further into the dairy industry so you can find out more in Liz's story in this week's paper. Yeah, it's great news for those guys. Yeah definitely. And Karina's been busy finding out about right to farm? Yeah so in 2013 uh, there was a draft bill introduced uh, in regards to right to farm that failed to get anywhere but Rob Broken she's come and um, introduced another draft bill which he's seeking consultation on from producers and from industry. So Karina's had a chat to PPSA and to the Ag Minister Leon Bignall um, so you can find out more about what's happening with that one uh, also on this week. Yeah and make sure you pick us up this week because we've got a great wrap of all the ram sales right across SA. We've all been doing a heap of kilometres so That's right. yeah, check that out. Yeah and we've also got Livestock Annual in this week. so Which we all went really <laughs> hard on for a few yards Absolutely. in there. Yep. So looking at feature breeds for the show and there's a few timetables in there as well. Of course we've got our show preview coming out next week but uh, you can find out a bit more about what's happening in the livestock world in the annual. Yeah so plenty to read in this week's stock journal. Absolutely.